a dog here trying to eat my sandwich. Yeah, aren't you? All right, well, I start away. filming now, he moves away like, yeah. I'm not even a part of this. Yeah, I'm a good dog. I'm a good dog. Nick, it's my dad. He's a bad dog. Hi. Well, hello there. Hi. Oh, hi. <laughs> Nick likes to stare at the sandwich. Hi. Yeah, hi. You're, gonna, you're making mama a liar? Grandma a liar? Like, no, Sam's just sitting in there over here, all by himself, not doing a thing. I just love my grandma. I don't want her sandwich. She loves it enough for me. Uh -huh. Yeah. Be careful. He's like, give me a sandwich, I'll give you a kiss. <laughs> That's exactly what I want. Hi, guys. Well, it is Monday, August 26th, I believe, uh, about 3.30 in the afternoon. I'm sitting here sweating my butt off, literally. <laughs> my chair is damp because I'm sweating. Of course, it doesn't help I always wear black pants, but I will wear nothing other than black pants or blue jeans because, yeah, any other color is not so flattering. So, uh, anyway, I'm just sitting here waiting. I thought old Charlotte here would be towed in today, but she, I don't think, is going to get there today. Maybe later on tonight, and I'll just have to spend the night there, I hope. Um, so, oops, I have a notification I have to get rid of. There we go. My sister, Trinka, is messaging me. Um, but anyway, uh, yeah, just sitting here. It's 97 degrees. Um, I am not minding the heat because I'm thinking one of these days it's going to start going south, and yeah. Then I'll be wishing for these hot days again. I'm itching. The flies are attacking me. I have a million flies in here. And I need a vacuum really bad. Our poor vacuum, we had a shop vac. And it pretty much died. So, uh, yeah. I'm going to have to uh, get us a new one one of these days. And boy, does my van need it. I have so much grass and dirt in here. It's not even funny, but oh well. Oh well, such is life. But anyway, I have today and tomorrow off. So just gonna enjoy tomorrow. We're supposed to be like in the 80s, so that should be pleasant, very pleasant. Oh, I gotta move my leg. Sorry. Ah, man, it stinks to get old. Can't cross my legs anymore. Well, I mean, I can cross my legs, but I have them put up on my. Uh, I use my trunk, my antique trunk, as a footstool, and then I can't feel my legs anymore. <laughs> because they fall asleep. So then I gotta try to move them. And I'm wiggling you guys. I'm not using the gimbal. I'm using my old reliable selfie stick here. So but yeah, just waiting around for the call from the uh, Mechanic Leonard. Um, he's busy, I know, this morning when I talked to him. He was with a customer, so he's a busy guy over there. But hopefully he'll get me in tomorrow. He has to get it in tomorrow and we have to figure out what's going on with her. I was kind of hoping we'd get her in today in case there's different issues so we'd have an extra day because I have to be to work on Wednesday or I probably won't have a job. Um, makes me very nervous anyway, but yeah, I have to get there. I've used pretty much most of my PTO time up, which is not good, but I called everybody. I could not find a ride. so. And I hate relying on people anyway, but, you know, it is what it is. So, but anyway, um, I was watching another video today of this, uh, I think they're called Tiny House Preppers. And she was talking about, I don't have it with me. Hold on. Hold that thought. I'll be right back. Hi, guys. Maybe a little friend on me. This is what the little tiny green bugs grow up to look like. I'm eating pizza and so everybody wants my pizza. Now I got the bugs begging for pizza, even. You are a strange looking little thing. Looks like he's like a dinosaur or something weird. Look at my hair. It's very humid today. It's kind of sprinkling. Yes, it's very moist. <laughs> it's very moist. Chris and I like saying moist. <laughs> so, but yeah, it's very moist today. 
the dogs are getting moist the dogs got hair too yeah look at this it's like oh my god you can tell it's very humid the humidity is like 93 percent or something like that fun fun so we're just waiting for the uh mechanic to come and pick us up and drag us over to the shop literally so alrighty we'll get back to you soon chris and i are eating a pizza here quick so we got something in our tummies because it'll probably take all day so talk to you later hi guys well we're still waiting for the mechanic to come and get us tow us over there so thought i'd continue on where i left you off yesterday um anyway i was talking about this uh I have to read from my notes. I made some notes. Sorry. Uh, chicory coffee. So basically what it is, is it's um, organic carob powder and organic raw dandelion root tea, uh, loose, um, and organic chicory root roasted. And then I'm going to add some chaga mushroom tea powder to it. Just a little bit and you use tiny tiny little bit i'm gonna have to get some tea bags uh, which i'm gonna order from amazon um get some tea bags and then i'm gonna have to steep it because i was an idiot with my instant coffee i threw away my pour over coffee thing and my leftover uh lulus <laughs> oh wait can't use that that's a technical term for mechanics um my filters leftover filters so so i'm gonna have to get some tea bags and i can just put a little bit in there and then i should be able to make a cup but i'll be able to drink that um i watched like i said i watched um elizabeth from tiny house preppers and um they uh they are actually my thrive life sponsors i joined up under them um i haven't really ordered anything from thrive life i got the samples that you get with the kit and everything but um but it'll be really cool once we get into the tiny house in a few years down the road um to start stocking up on that kind of stuff and i want to start using it you know slowly here and there but it's just so much easier to you know get walmart and since i'm there every day anyway mostly so anyway so i thought i'd try that and uh i will definitely let you guys know how i like it um and i wanted to do a shout out i've met some new wonderful friends up north um they are in uh, Montreal, Quebec, Canada, and they are redoing a road tech that they got, an older road tech. I don't remember the year right now, but their names are Justin and Christina's RV Van Life, and I will put the link in the description below. They are wonderful, wonderful people. Um, she does exercise videos. They have wonderful, wonderful, very contagious energy. Um, they have a beautiful dog angel who's along for the ride and they've made room in their van for angels so they're poop dog people and we love that so all right i'm going to link it below check out their channel give them some love they're building their channel like the rest of us are so all right i love you all dance like no one's watching we'll see you in the next video hopefully with charlotte running